existed half a billion years ago below the surface of the Cambrian seas. These animals are among the first complex creatures to appear in the fossil record. Most of them would have fit into the palm of your hand. Here they are reconstructed at 12 times their actual size. Two worm-like Aishea confront each other on a sponge. Claw-like hooks at the end of each leg holds them firmly to the sponge's soft surface. The large predator Sibnea prowls the muddy seafloor, while Ilex Brankiocaris glides above. In the midst of concealing sponges, looms the large predator Anomalocaris. Its prey, the putative crustacean Canadaspis, swims desperately to avoid capture in the spiked claws. Above, with three tail fins and big eyes, swims Odorizer, too large to worry about being attacked. Descending to the surface of the seafloor beneath you, a school of Morella, the most common of the shale's creatures, is diverted by the larger trilobite, Oronoides. Nearby, the carnivorous worm, Luisella, telescopes from its burrow to threaten the cone-shelled bottom dweller, Haplophrentis. Grooming a sponge for prey, the carnivore, Leoncolia, senses its world with whip-like tentacles. Above, Nectoparis with a fish-like body and insect-like head hunts for smaller prey. Higher yet swims a translucent Nakaya, noted for the stiff rod along its back. With this precursor of a backbone, Pakaya is among our earliest ancestors. Ambushing an unsuspecting Yahweh, pride-eyed Opavinia prepares to feed. Below, Halicigenia steps delicately across a decaying sponge. Rows of protective spines make Halicigenia an unappealing target for predators. What events in tin such as a strange zoo of delicate creatures? Or storms or mudslides swim them in their tent on stagnant waters when they were finally buried, resurfacing 500 million years late as the fossils of the British ship. Definitely afraid of this one. Seriously? Yeah. 